So this is going to be just a short video on the shooting space that we've incorporated into our home. Um, you don't always have to have a rented studio space in order to create amazing portraits. All of the portraits that I've created that you can find on my website at pimentelportfolio.com, on our YouTube channel, on our Instagram at Pimentel Portfolio, which by the way, please check out, subscribe, and share. Um, all of those images, the majority of them, have been shot in the home studio space that we've created. We sometimes will shoot up here in our kitchen area. It's got incredible light. Uh, you know, some of the world's best portrait photographers shoot in some very small spaces. I find myself wanting to shoot in a smaller and smaller environment so that I can control the light. This kitchen area is incredible for shooting. We've scrim lighted, we've bounced light, and it's really close to the espresso machine, which is a perk. Um, I'm going to show you the downstairs shooting space, so let's go. So this space, um, which is about half of the basement area, is where we set up and shoot. Um, have a couple of huge umbrellas that we're using right now. Westcott umbrellas, I believe they are. And behind there is where you'll find um, a lot of the V-flats that we use. We've hand-painted most of our V-flats. And the light that comes in is a very small window. So we use that window and we use that window when we're doing some of our natural light shooting. This is the area that I used when we did our white sheet portrait shoot that has seemed to have had a lot of response. And I'm gonna say it one more time. It really doesn't matter where you shoot. It doesn't matter what you shoot, the equipment that you have. It's your creativity and the practice practice that comes with it.